What is that giant big box that is made in China? The question is, what's that smell? Sausage. Okay. Beyond sausage. Right now it is beyond sausage. But um, our uh, neighbors would say that other smells are coming from our house. So we Your are, farts? No. Uh, we have a, a make block uh, acrylic laser cutter, kind of like a Glowforge. And, uh, Better than a Glowforge. And, yeah, and it spits out the exhaust with this. We actually have a pretty good like fan that sucks it out the window through a little vent we actually made out of a board. And, uh, and I have a video it, about it. It works pretty well. Uh, you still don't want to be in the same room as it, but if the wind is going the wrong way, our neighbor's window is only, I don't know, a couple of yards away. It used to be two feet away. Yeah, we moved it, uh, when we found that out, and they were very nice about it, but we're trying, we've been trying to find ways where, you know, we're not going to be bothering people, and maybe even we can be in the same room with the, uh, the device while we're using it, because it's really not good for you to breathe that stuff in. And we have masks, but it's yeah. not ideal. The mirrored acrylic seems to be one of the worst. Oh, yeah. And the ones from Smoky Hill Design which we have many unboxings for, uh, they actually don't seem to smell as bad. So this was on a solution that you researched and found. Did you find it by looking I didn't research. Filters? Someone in, I think, a Smoky Hill group was like, look what I got. Yeah? And did people say it was good? Yes. Okay, so it's from a company called Vev Vivor, Vevor, and it's a smoke purifying uh, filter. And we and got the more expensive one. Yeah, Woo the one that has two. And um, it's, it's marketed for... Um, it's marketed for soldering, mm -hmm. so you're really not supposed to breathe it in if you're soldering a lot. And yeah, it has a bamboo tube, a smoke hood, a top cover, a flange, uh, flange switch, hasp, host. I don't know what those Lots are. of words. Lots of random things. There's a lot to learn. But uh, theoretically, you point it right at the device and you don't even need to have it out a window. It just eats it. Uh, Excuse so. Smiley and his bark box toy. Yeah. <laughs> Isaac, so, there's a fan above your head. There's the device. Oh, I'm going to put stickers on it. This is the filter stuff, you know, that you put in it. And, and they say you can buy a cheaper version of that oh, to okay. replace it with. Like, it's kind of like a fish tank. Like, you can buy one marketed for fish or you can get... Uh, marketed. no, you get a fancy one that's marketed for air quality. But... but yes, you can buy it in bulk maybe. If not here, bulk. fume extractor. And this is one of the, like, you know, things that goes on the end of it. Um, it's very it looks exciting. like it's fairly simple, actually. comes with these pieces. Yep. And why do we get two? Because there's two hoses. Two uh, spouts. You can, there is a model. Uh, this one's like 370 or something like that. Something like that. And the one that's only one is around 300. So it's, or maybe 290 or something. But it's, it's I don't know. I think it's worth it for double the price. Plus, I want one to be right where the thing is coming out. Um, right where the hoses but then i want another one above it because there are gaps and it does come out of everywhere yeah so i just want it to be everywhere wow so it's really simple um, let's see isaac mess it up after saying it's simple oh i love how bendy these are and how they stay upright yeah well so that's a hit me does it, it just goes straight in there i think and then this thing goes on the other end i'm not even reading the instructions you probably should <laughs> But it seems pretty self-explanatory. Can you put it uh, in there better? And then you can do just one. And we have a fan right there. Yeah, you can do just one. Uh, and I guess there's like a cover here that you can just take off and do a second one. My idea to get two is also because that room is full of other crafts. Like, what if we want to do something else at the same time? 3D printing, which does make some fumes, not as many, but some... And it looks like a bug right now. I like it. That's kind of cool. And I guess this just goes... Is this where it sucks it in? Yeah. So we point that at whatever yep. is the problem. And there's two. So we have two problems. That's like, one can be pointed simple. at your butt and one at my machine. Wow, cool. <laughs> you didn't hear what I said, did you? <laughs> yeah, that's a good uh, good call. At night, we'll put yeah. this in the bedroom. And so you can open it like this, and this is where the, there's already... Isaac, stop lifting it above your head. stuff... In filter is stuff. Wow. wow. Yeah. Okay, so that's gonna get nasty, I bet. Oh yeah. <laughs> so. And we'll show you how it works another time. But this is our Vivor. Are you gonna make it a heart? Oh. Make it a. Oh. Leader. Oh my. Take me to your leader. Oh my. No, Millie. <laughs> oh no.
<laughs> Smiley, mealy, sorry dog, sorry. You're supposed to put it 150 millimeters from the point where it's coming out, so not right up against it. So it's it cuts for 150 soldering. millimeters is... Uh, 15 centimeters. I know, but that's like 7 inches or something, so it's like that much. Cool. Aloha. Aloha. This is Olana. And I'm Isaac. We're, we're moving, moving to, to Hawaii. Hawaii! But first... We're driving from New York City to Seattle. With Smiley, our nine-year-old rescue pity. In our Tesla Model 3, equipped for camping. And we are funding this trip with our Etsy store. Meaning we are bringing around 50,000 earrings. And 500 envelopes. And our label printer. On this 11-day cross-country road trip. Subscribe to the Travel Bug Bite today! If you liked our video, don't forget to click the like button, leave a comment, and subscribe. Check out our videos from all around the world and let us know what you'd like to see next. Thanks for watching!